Yo, what is going on, guys? And today I want to talk about Scottie Pippen Jr., who just declared for the NBA draft. He was a sophomore at Vanderbilt. He's a six foot, one hundred seventy pound guard, and he scored twenty point eight points, two point nine rebounds, four point nine assists, and shot forty two percent from the field per game this past season in twenty two games, and he shot thirty five percent from the field and he really these numbers are huge he went from a 12 point score in his freshman year to a 24 basically a 21 point score in his sophomore year and he is the son of hall of famer scotty pippen the man who was a chicago bull legendary dairy basketball player as you guys know but the difference is scotty pippen was a small forward big guy six foot eight scotty pippen's junior is six foot one but and the thing is he is a skilled combo guard that really can shoot and score the basketball in so many ways and he's really good at racking up skills this past year he had about two steals a game and the year before he had 1.1 steals per game so he shows he can be a really good per perimeter defender and he's taken a huge role like i said this year and I think he could be a late first round prospect, early second round. He's a really good shooter, shown that he can hit that shot deep, even though it's like 36%. He's a great shooter off the dribble, shown that he can be a catch and shoot shooter. Just needs to work on the off ball, getting into position better. And he is great at generating free throws. He's an 85% free throw shooter. But if you didn't know, he literally this past year got almost eight, went to the line and shot eight free throws a game. So he went to the line about four or five times a game, which is awesome. And he's a decent playmaker. As I said, he had about five assists. I see him as being kind of a point guard or a undersized combo guard. Though he's a good athlete, an above average athlete, but people with an elite step or those elite athletes like Anthony Edwards are going to beat him. Uh, and he's not the most consistent shooter, as I said. Like sometimes he'll go on streaks, but he's still a good shooter and he can be careless on offense and foul prone where he this past year at 2.7 3.8 turnovers game the year before he had 2.7 so that is one thing to be concerned and that the fact that he is a little bit undersized 6'1 170 pounds but hey it, you know i think he's gonna be good sucks that his mom's sucking malik beasley's dick that was weird that was a whole awkward situation for him i don't even know why i brought that up i'm pretty baked but yeah, I hope this guy balls out and has a good career. That's it, guys. I want to hear where you guys think he's going to get drafted. I think he's going to be a late first round pick, early second round. I think he can get drafted.